From the University of California at Davis, this is News Watch. Using genetic profiling equipment, researchers in this UC Davis laboratory have confirmed that the cradle of civilization for cats lies in the Middle East. So that's pretty good. Yeah, it looks good. It amplified all the, all the markers. These researchers collected cell samples from more than 1,000 cats worldwide. Leslie Lyons, a cat geneticist, says their gene pools quickly spread throughout the world. So we think they got around to particularly the New World and to Australia and places like that by actually being members, working members on a ship in order to help keep the rodent population under control. Scientist Monica Lipinski says more than 200 genetic disorders have been identified in modern cats and many are found in purebreds. It lets the breeders know um, in a way where the how diverse their breeds are at present and um, how well they're doing at pre preserving the genetic diversity that they have. The researchers say breeders need to be careful because once a bad gene becomes established, it will quickly increase in frequency. This research has personal meaning for Lipinski. So there is a genetic disease in, um, in cats, which is the same as what I have, or very similar, spinal muscular atrophy and um, it gives uh, uh, people like me hope that if we can find the answer in the cat, we will be able to um, use that to help people. Paul Fotenauer reporting from UC Davis. For more information, please log on to broadcast.ucdavis.edu.